welcome back to my channel. Jessie here, aka Miss Tricky Holic. I am so excited for today's video, guys, because ito na my US beauty haul. a US beauty haul because I went to LA specifically last January at we had our new year there and ayun pumunta na naman kami sa LA biglaan lang yung trip guys because accompanied my Lola so you'll see that more on the vlogs so mauna siguro yung vlogs and then ito kasi ito yung haul without further ado let's go to the haul oh god so guys ito siya ganito siya kabigat sobrang bigat nito everything aray Everything is inside. So, paano ba natin ito gagawin? Siguro magsa-start tayo sa mga beauty tools muna. Hopefully, wala akong ma-miss out. Let's start with a sponge. Kasi yung mga sponge, nilagay ko na sila dito sa Ziploc to segregate everything. Let's start with these two sponges. I got these two from Morphe. This is the Highlight and Contour Beauty Sponge. So, it has dalawang angle. Meron dito. Meron dito. I tried this a lot of times na okay naman siya for contour. Like, maganda nito for baking, guys. Even though I do not really bake. Pero maganda to kasi precise siya. And then, pwede rin siya sa under eye. So, kaya lang. Ugh. Kunit ko na siya. I don't know nakikita nyo yan. Na ganun ko siya eh. Masyado ko siyang na-scrub. So, dapat pala be careful din with the sponge. Handle it then with care when you wash them. And then, the next one is their Flawless Beauty Sponge. So, it's not that soft. Unlike, kung napanood nyo yung beauty haul ko last time, Elf Total Face Sponge. Grabe. Sobrang lambot. Malambot din naman to, pero iba lang yung pagkalambot to. I do not regret buying this. Okay naman siya. I do love sponges. Kasi mahilig ako sa mga liquid foundations, cream products. So, okay lang kahit madaming sponges. And guys, when I'm saying madaming sponges, madami to. So, speaking of Total Face Sponge ng Elf, I bought two backups. So, talagang gustong gusto ko tong sponge na to that I had to buy two. Dalawa yung backup ko. So, ito yung first one ko. Sobrang dumi na. Ayan, ito yung bago. Tingnan nyo guys kung gano ka lambot. Hindi pa to wet. So, dry pa to ang lambot na. What more pag wet. So, ang ganda talaga nito. Maganda siya mag-blend sa skin, pag sa foundation, parang airbrush finish lang. And, mga cream products din. Kaya, I really had to buy a backup. So, more from ELF. Kasi, madami ako biniling ELF sponges dahil nagsuwang ko talaga yung total face sponge. So, I wanted to try more sponges from ELF. This is the blending plus highlighting sponge duo. So, yung isa daw, one for liquid and one for powder. I believe this is is the one for liquid. Oh, wow! Guys, di ako sure kung magkasing lambot sila, pero parang mas malambot to. I am very excited to use this. So, makikita nyo tong mga sponges na to and all these items sa mga future videos ko. And this one is for powder. Ito yung highlighting sponge duo. So, pwede rin natin to try sa future for the highlight. Very simple lang yung makeup ko today. Actually, Matutulog na dapat ako guys, pero sabi ko no, kailangan kong mag-film dahil sobrang behind na ako. Kaya ayan, medyo simple lang yung makeup ko. Nag-earring sa ako and konting makeup. Hindi pa rin natatapos yung aking elf craze. Bumili pa ako ng Precision Sponge Trio. Latex free. So this is for, ah, pwede siya sa cream, liquid, and powder makeup. Pero matigas siya. But I don't know, I haven't tested it. Baka naman pag latex free, matigas talaga. In the future, test natin yan. And hindi pa rin natatapos guys in sponge madness. I got two more sponges from Eco Tools naman. This is the Perfecting Blender Duo. So I'm very excited then about this because it states na it's best with liquid and cream makeup. And you know guys, how much I love cream products. So very excited to try this. And this one, this is the Perfecting Cushion Blender. So it's more for cushions. I don't know if you can see it. But I think pwede din naman to for like liquid and cream products. So we'll see. Yung mga 
sponge. Last for the sponge is this one. I got this sa isang set ng Real Techniques. I just got the basic sponge from Real Techniques. I'm sure alam na alam niyo na itong sponge na ito. Well, sa beauty tools pa rin tayo kasi no joke guys, madami-dami talaga ito. Hindi ko nga alam kung ano mas madami yung pagbili ko. So kayo na lang siguro mag-comment kung ano tingin nyo mas madami ba yung binili ko last time or this time. So I'm just gonna share with you all that I bought beauty related. Next is this Eco Tools Mini Mask Mate 4 piece mess free masking kit. So actually hindi ako nagmamask pero it's a good buy, di ba? Para matry ko naman magmask. And I only got this for $3 sa TJ Maxx. Grabe ang dami. I think I got this for a dollar each. So we have all kinds of eyeshadow brushes from Elf. So hindi ko na yung papakita isa-isa pero I have the eye crease brush, eyeshadow brush, blending eye brush, concealer brush, smudge brush, and eyeliner brush. So finally, dahil napakita ko na sa inyo, maglalaban, maglalaban, mahuhugasan ko na to and magagamit ko na sila. I think this is $20 kasama yung sponge. So actually, this is just a blush brush. I do have Real Techniques brushes, pero wala akong blush brush. So, very excited ako dito. Tama naman, blush is life. And ito rin setting brush nila. So, pwede rin to for highlight. And then, we have their Expert Face Brush. So, if you saw from my first beauty haul, may binili na akong ganito, pero maliit siya. Sana naman ko pa na-discover to Expert Face Brush kasi okay talaga siya kahit saan. Blush, highlight, bronzer, contour, foundation, and then last we have the deluxe crease brush. So, medyo malaki siya na brush. Speaking of maliit, I also got this mini medium sculpting brush. Ito yung lahat kong nilalagay sa bag ko if hindi ito yung expert face brush. For everyday, ayaw ko naglalagay ng brush set kasi mabigat siya sa bag. And then, we have Age Cosmetics. I think ha, this is the Aurora brush set. I got this kasi sa Marshalls. Kung hindi Marshalls, TJ Maxx. Kasi halos yung Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and Ross Dress for Less, they're almost the same. Like, their supplier, kumaga, if, if you saw an item sa DJ Max, most likely meron din sa Marshalls or sa Ross Dress for Less. Finally, since napakita ko na rin sila sa inyo, malalaban ko. Mahugasan ko na sila. So, set talaga siya. Walang names though sa brushes, pero okay lang. Guys, ang lambot. Grabe. Okay. So, tomorrow, maghugas ako ng madaming brushes. Okay, this one. Three Pocket Expert Organizer. Ang mali ko lang dito, natapon ko yung parang pangdikit niya. So, I don't know kung pwedeng any dikit, pero parang hindi na siya dumidikit. Pero okay lang, kahit parang nakaganan lang. Ang purpose kasi nito is for the mirror. So, ididikit mo sa mirror. Ah, okay. Dumidikit siya, guys. Ay. Okay. So, hindi na nga siya dumidikit sa mirror. Supposedly, because nata na natapon ko na yung plastic. I saw kasi sa Real Techniques website or parang Instagram ata nila na you can wash this pala and then ibabalik mo lang yung plastic and then it, pwede mo lang idikit ulit sa wall. Pwede rin siyang pang travel. Idikit mo. Kaya nga lang na wala ko. So, wala. Parang nakaganyan na lang siya sa bathroom ko. So, every time I wash my brushes, dito ko rin sila nilalagay. I also got this pretty cheap price eh. Alam ko sa Marshalls ko dito binili. Kaya, good deal pa rin. Kahit na wala ko yung plastic. Hindi to makeup related guys or beauty related. Pero share ko lang kasi gusto ko tong ilagay. Oh my god! Ang ganda guys. So, this is the LED light na lips. So, you know naman, I love lipsticks. Well, liquid lipsticks to be exact. Anything lips, gustong gusto ko. So, napabili ako nito. And, bala ko siyang ilagay yung so, hopefully sa future malagay natin. Ay, ito muna. So, hindi ko muna papakita yung laman kasi may mga laman pang makeup. But I got these two. So, may laman sila pareho. Oh. I super love this bag. I think nakita niyo na ata ito. Hindi ako sure. Pero this is my makeup bag. So, papakita ko sa inyo yung compartment. But, don't mind ko ano yung laman. So, I got this from 
rough dress for less yata. Hindi ko na matandaan guys, basta isa doon. Meron siyang four compartments. One, two, three, four. So I put all my favorite lip and cheek tips or any multi-purpose products dito. Kaya punong-puno siya. And then, para tear, no? I also got this. Both of them, okay to sila pang travel. Actually, mas... For me, mas okay nga to, kasi mas maliit. Pero okay yun kasi naka-stand siya, tas naka... Yung kukunin mo na lang when you travel. Ito kasi, nakahiga siya. Ayan, sneak peek sa mga papakita ko sa inyo. So, meron siyang compartment dito, zipper, then here, and then meron pa here, may isa. So, we have four zippers. Okay naman siya kasi medyo nage-expand. And super cute nung print, di ba? Ang ganda lang. Oh! Wait, may nakalimutan ako. So actually ito, hindi ko to binili sa US. Kasi nabili ko to nung nasa US ako. So, I love Wet n Wild. And then nakita ko Walmart, specifically at Target. They sell yung brushes, tigi-tigi sa. If you watch yung beauty haul ko last time, yung e.l.f. Bumili ako ng flawless ata ng brush set. Gusto ko kasi talaga guys set. Kung napapansin nyo, puro sets yung binibili ko. Ayaw ko kasi bumibili ng isa-isa. Nakita ko yun and gusto gusto ko sana yun. Kaya lang nakahassle akong bilhin sila isa-isa. So I told Koy na baka pwedeng bilhin niya for me. So binili niya ito sa website and naka-sale pa. So ito yung 17... 17? Oh! 17 piece brush roll. Sobrang lambot. Tingnan nyo guys kung gano'n siya kalambot. Hindi ko pa rin ito nahuhugasan. So huhugasan ko na ito. I was very excited nung nakita ko yung lalagyan. Ang ganda nung lalagyan niya. Perfect when you travel talaga. Hindi pa nagkatapos dun guys. Buti na lang nakita ko kasi nasa floor. So I also got this 10 piece pro line brush set. Ayan sila guys. Wow! They are so pretty and super soft din sila. Grabe, tinan nyo. Kita nyo ba yan? It is so soft. Let's start with Sephora. I went to Sephora, yung sa may Santa Anita Mall in West Covina. I was supposed to only buy this bomb baby. So, meron siya no gloss. Super love ko yung gloss na yun, yung universal shade nila, gloss bomb. And I am very excited for this Hustla baby. Actually, swatch na nga natin. Oh my God, ang cute. First, Fenty Beauty ko to guys. Na ano, na fit. Oh, ang liit lang niya. It's so cute. Watch natin. Ang ganda, may FB pa nakasulat dyan. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was just one swipe. Okay, Fenty Beauty. I see you. Actually, besides this, nakakuha ako ng swatch eh. So, Sephora kasi, you can ask what's your foundation shade and then bibigyan ka nila ng sample. Hindi ko lang alam ko nandito pa. But anyway, so dapat nga, isa lang ang bibiling ko sa Sephora. Kaya lang nasama ko si Tita Sana and wala lang. Parang, naisip ko din kasi kailan pa ako pupunta sa Sephora. So, I got more stuff. This is the, pero puro minis lang guys. Kasi I love minis. Joey Rose Gold Powder Highlighter Collection pero may liquid lipstick. Oh my god! Ang cute talaga. <laughs> this is in the shade Rose Gold. Watch na nga natin. Huh? Okay guys, Rose Gold siya pero gold lumalabas sa skin ko. I don't know when you swatch it here. Kung medyo pinagpapawisan na ako, mainit talaga dito sa Pilipinas. And then this one is Rose Gold din. Ah, so talaga Rose Gold collection siya. Rose Gold din lahat. So Rose Gold lahat. Everything is Rose Gold from the highlighter, lip cream, and the lip topper. Ang dami kong pinili guys sa Sephora. Oh my gosh. I got two cat on the Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Minis. So this is Ruthless and Milag. Ang gaganda ng colors nito guys. And then I also got, I think I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 items from Sephora. This one is the Stila Liquid Eyeshadow. So Minis lang guys. Sunset Fire, Follow the Sun, and Burnished Sienna. Wow. Binalikan ko pa to kasi si Tita Sana, may tita, she bought this. And then, actually, I told her about this. Akala ko kasi, Charlotte Tilbury liquid lipstick, I thought, apat yung laman. Yung pala, nung binuksan namin, dalawa lang. So, parang, mm, hindi na ako bumili. Pero, <laughs> nagsisig ako, so binalikan ko rin. So, these two, we have, too bad, I'm bad. 
is this shade and then we have showgirl and now let's move on to ulta the emily noel the ones palette i use this na sa japan so pag nakita niyo yung vlogs okay naman yung shades nito pero hindi siya super pigmented so medyo mas pang beginner siya which is okay lang madali naman siya i-build up pero hindi lang ako super na wow sa kanya okay naman i don't know i don't know I do not regret buying this because I want to support Emily Noel. And okay din to guys for traveling. Tsaka magaganda yung shade selection niya. Kakaiba. And may mirror siya. Super big mirror. So okay ako dun. Colourpop Misunderstood Eyeshadow Palette. The Villains Edition. Guys, ang gaganda ng shades. Nakita niyo ba eh? Sorry, nag-reflect. Swatch natin na ah, context. Sobrang excited ako. Kanyari itong gold. Oh, wow. Para siyang metallic glittery gold. Kita niyo! Wow, I think I'm gonna use this soon. Ganda. And then, ang mga binili ko pa, lalalasina na, I got the Colourpop Brow Boss Pencil. Kaya lang wala na, ubus na to. Kasi when I was in the US, naubusan ako ng sunnies. And I also got pala, I forgot to mention, itong ELF Ultra Precise Brow Pencil. Okay siya guys, ang dami nitong laman and it's very cheap. Sabi nila, dupe daw to for the Anastasia Brow Wings. And yun, yung Colourpop, walang wala na. But I did like this. And I also have, na nasa makeup kit ko na siya ito, yung Brow Boss Gel. In clear, I love this kasi talagang nagkakaroon ng effect yung feathery brow. So, okay na okay ko. I also got the Tarte Shape Tape. Wow! May Tarte na ako. Pero mini edition lang guys. Ang kanilang concealer. I got mine in the shade Light to Medium. This one, I only got House of Lashes, Boss Eyelashes, Boudoir Light. Hindi siya nagpo-focus. I bought this because of one of my favorite YouTubers here, Judy C. So, she loves this, yung House of Lashes Boudoir Light. Talagang I had to get one. And parang ayaw ko nga gamitin. Pero maganda daw to. So, I've never tried Glossier Cloud Paints. But, I found out na meron siyang dupe. So, hindi ko pa na natatry. Pero, I got, I think almost all the shades. May two shades yata akong kulang. These are the Flower Beauty Blush Bombs. So, Flower Beauty is a makeup brand of Drew Barrymore. I found out about these blush bombs from Kathleen Lights. Kaya lang yung favorite shade niya, ubus na eh. Mga dupes daw talaga to eh. Even the color. Mag-try tayo ng isa. Gana siya ay pinched. Cute nung packaging niya. And let's see. Oh, wow! Okay, hindi siya nakikita sa camera. Ito yung darkest at dali lang shade. So, siguro makikita niya na to. Parang sa nakikita ko, dupe nga siya ng Glossier. Because I know Glossier, hindi siya ganun ka-pigmented. So, parang ganun din to. Kakaiba yung applicator niya. Nakakatuwa. Kasi it's clear. Oh, can you see that? Oh, wow. Oh, ang ganda. Oh, my God. Ang ganda niya, guys. Very excited to use them. Ito mga random stuff na lang. So, parang iba na kuha ko to sa Walmart, Target, or sa TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and Ross Dress for less. I got this highlighter from Wet n Wild. This is in the shade Bloom Time. So, Kathleen Light's recommendation ko. I think I got this sa uh, Target. So, this is the Physician's Formula Muru Muru Baby Butter Box. So, may perfume. And then, we have the eyeshadow duo. The bronzer. The highlighter. And I guess this is a lip cream. So, a perfect way to try out Physician's Formula. These three. So, you know guys, I love eyeshadow palettes. And I just had to get these when I found them sa Marshalls and TJ Max for $12.99. We have the Clara Cosmetics Malibu Palette. Hindi ko na siya isa swatch, guys. Ganda ng shades. I think we have 24 shades. So, madami-dami. I also got the Marrakesh. Ang cute din ang packaging nila, guys. Kasi hindi lang siya dun sa box. Pati sa actual palette. Nakalagay yung eye design niya. Marrakesh Palette. Okay! Since na-swipe ko ng kamay ko, ang gusto na, oh, okay, may potential siya. Tamaan siya ng finger ko. Okay, it's pigmented. Not too pigmented, pero okay naman siya. For $13, and then last but not the least, I got this Bondi. So, I went to Australia two years ago yata. And we went to Bondi Beach. Kaya ako ito binili. Sayang nga guys, hindi pa ako nag-vlog nun eh. Pero ayan. Ito mga blue colors to. Very excited. Because sa 
summer ngayon, even though medyo palapos na, kahit naman rainy season, blue is still in. So, very excited to create looks with this. Especially tong si Bondi. Because of those blue tones. I also got this from TJ Maxx. This is the Profusion Cosmetics Wonderlust Palette. Meron pa siyang brush na kasama. Ayan. And okay yung brush niya. Malambot yung brush niya. Dual-ended. May isang shader and blending brush. And yung colors nitong Wonderlust, we have neutrals to green, blues, and purple. Wala nga lang siyang mirror, pero 7 bucks. This has 21 shades. Now, wala na yung takip, guys, but I also got these Milani Make It Last Brace. So, I got a mini version of this last time, and paubos na yung ganun ko. So, I had to buy a backup. Bumili na ako ng regular size. And I also got the dewy version. Yung black version nila. Yun yung matte. Hindi ko na siya binili kasi ang dami ko ng sprays. I forgot to mention, binili ko itong dalawa sa Ulta. So, these are the Juvia's Place. Finally, may Juvia's Place na ako. We have the Magic Mini. Actually, sorry, hindi pala finally. Regalo pala sa akin si Koy. I'm so sorry, Koy. Ang Juvia's Place, pero hindi ko pa natatry. Pero ito. So, we have the Magic Mini. Gosh, ang ganda nung shades. Kakaiba siya, no? Yung color scheme niya. Parang bluish, green, orange. So, parang ang ganda nito for summer. And then, we have like a rainbow palette, which is the Masquerade. Mini. Yung eyeshadow palette, okay na rin yung mini. At yung mini nila guys, hindi nga mini eh. Very excited to try this. So, makikita nyo yun. Kung nakita nyo sa vlog, kasi mag-una yung vlog bago to, watch ko yung Juvia's Place. And actually, last January pa, nung swatch ko to, gusto, gusto ko talaga tong bilhin. Kasi mahilig ako sa mga ganito eh. Yung parang colorful eyeshadow palette. Kaya lang, dahil siguro Christmas season, having out of stock. Pero, finally, nakabili din. Konti na lang guys. Napit na tayo matapos. These palettes from BH Cosmetics, I got all of them from Marshalls and BJ Maxx. This is the It's My Ray Ray Eyeshadow and Highlighter and Contour Palette. Ang mura lang nito guys. $8 ko lang nabili. $7.99. So meron na siyang highlighter and bronzer. And ito yung eyeshadows niya. Ano lang siya, neutrals, pero pwede rin siyang pang smoky. Sorry, nag-reflect siya. Okay din to pang travel kasi ang liit lang niya eh. Tapos meron ka ng pang contour, di ba? Very sleek din. And then I got this Royal Affair 20 Eyeshadow Palette. Binili ko lang itong mga beige cosmetics kasi naka-sale siya. Ganda, no? Parang kakaiba yung shades niya. Kasi parang akala mo neutrals, kasi may pop of green, blue. Last but not the least, from BH Cosmetics. I got this, guys, kasi super cute niya. This is the Barbie Corn. Oh my god! Kita niyo ba yan, guys? May unicorn. Ay, may plastic pa, kaya nagre-reflect. Sorry. So, may highlighters and eyeshadow. Very simple lang yung color. Hindi siya exciting. It's color scheme. Color scheme niya. Kasi green, pink, and then purple. Parang unicorn nga. Pero, and then ang dami niyang neutrals. Pero, kaya ako napabili because of the packaging. Kasi yung mirror niya, may clouds pa. Super cute! Kung mapapansin niyo guys, hindi ko na alam kung ilan. Pero, ang dami kong biniling eyeshadow palettes na naman. Finally, we are down to the last yung last three products na binili ko. Inorder ko to sa Amazon. So all three are from CC Color Cosmetics. CC Color Cosmetics are made in China. Para siya may mga bad habit beauty dupes. I believe yung CC Color Cosmetics, yung mga owners nito are makeup artists na gusto nila mag-create ng makeup line pero dupe shadows siya. So if you're familiar with this, it looks like the Mani MUA palette. Like sa drag yata. If I haven't tested this out, naka-plastic pa talaga. And then we have this one. So this is Around the World Palette. So this is a dupe for the Urban Decay. Ano ba tawag to? I forgot eh. Kasi yung parang travel palette nila. Very excited din ako yung try ito. And last but not the least for all the items that I got, the Birthday Blast. So, if you're wondering kung anong dupe nito, you guessed it right, the Kylie Birthday Palette. Sobrang excited ako dito guys. I love Kylie Cosmetics in general, kaya lang namamahalan ako. Same with the Huda Beauty. Medyo parang napapaisip ako to go and get the dupes na lang para at least mas madami ako mabili. And, pero syempre, formula-wise, I'm sure it's not the same. We'll see, pero tingin ko hindi. Punong-puno to kanina. I can't believe na natapos ko to. Natanggal ko na lahat ng items and wala siyang laman. So, you know guys, that's it for 
this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give it a big thumbs up if you like it. And please subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have subscribed to my channel, don't forget to click the notification bell down below so you are notified whenever I upload new videos. Guys, ahabol ako. Madami madami pa tayong videos na panatay. Travel vlogs man yan, hauls, reviews. I got you. So yeah guys, I'll see you again next time.